Protecting thousands of Stockton homes from flooding, that's the focus of a multi-million dollar effort being highlighted today along the San Joaquin River. The goal is for homeowners near the Smith Canal area to soon be able to remove that high-risk flood zone designation. And KC3's Mike Tissell is live in Stockton with more on what's happening in just a few hours. Mike. Right behind me is the San Joaquin River and just a stone's throw from where we are is where this river branches off into the Smith Canal. This spot is the spot for a first of its kind floodgate. Now take a look happening at noon will be the ribbon cutting and commissioning of a $96 million project that is described as the quote first ever floodgate of its kind west of the Mississippi. Why is that significant? Well, state and federal authorities will be here to highlight that this is going to provide, quote, unprecedented levels of flood protection to an economically disadvantaged area in central Stockton. This is the area uh, near and along Monte Diablo Avenue covering approximately 8,500 homes and properties. This all being done as part of Flood Preparedness Week. Now, Back out here, the new floodgate will also be integrated into a much bigger $1.4 billion Army Corps of Engineers Lower San Joaquin River project, which will include 23 miles of levee improvements. The ribbon cutting happening today at noon. Live in Stockton, Mike Sell, KCI Race for News. All right, thanks so much, Mike. Time is now 7.35. U.S. Congressman Josh Harder and State Senator Susan Eggman are also expected to join flood control officials for today's ceremony.